things even more jolly. There were so many blinking lights on the house, they induced neighborhood-wide seizures. So I take it you don't want to help us trim the tree? I do not, but if you insist on decorating a spider-infested fire hazard in my home, I would request that you add this. What is it? You're kidding, right? It's a bust of Sir Isaac Newton. Oh, sure, sure. Uh, very Christmassy. Wait, excuse me, but it's much more Christmassy than anything you've put on the tree. Here we go. <laughs> December 25th, 1642, Julian calendar. Sir Isaac Newton is born. Jesus, on the other hand, was actually born in the summer. His birthday was moved to coincide with a traditional pagan holiday that celebrated the winter solstice with lit fires and slaughtered goats. <laughs> Which frankly sounds like more fun than 12 hours of church with my mother followed by a fruitcake. <laughs> Mary Newton, miss everyone. I sense that's not sincere, although I have no idea why. No, it's fine. Look, Sir Isaac can go right next to this little candy cane. No, Isaac goes at the top of the tree. No, he doesn't. I understand. You dispute Newton's claim that he invented calculus, and you want to put Gottfried Leibniz on the top. Yeah, you got me. I'm a Leibniz man. Well, perhaps when your mother gets here, she'll talk some sense into you. What? Your, your mother's coming when? Tomorrow. When were you going to tell me? Um, tomorrow? Why were you keeping this a secret? Well, I just, if I thought... If I can interject here, 